Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Tom Ogomi, and today we are back with another statue tutorial, the last one of 2015 for the channel. So, hopefully you guys enjoy, and if you do, definitely consider leaving a like. Again, this is the last video of the year, and uh, hopefully in the next year we can improve, make the channel so much better, and of course, keep the growth going, because it is really, really insane. I mentioned in the previous video and the one before that about the milestones we've hit this year, it's insane, and I really do appreciate all the support. Um, and that's pretty much all I can say really. I could waffle on for ages about how much this means to me. Um, but instead, I could provide you with these three plushy tutorials, of which I've already done two. This is the third and final to uh, wrap up the year on a high. So hopefully you enjoy again, and uh, I will see you in the tutorial. Okay guys, so we're going to start off the tutorial by listing off the blocks you'll need. So you'll need snow for the body, you'll need black wool for the buttons, light blue, for the scarf, blue for the scarf, and also orange for the carrot nose. So what we're going to start off by doing is placing six snow in a row, and that rhymes. And we're going to do the exact same again. Next, what we're going to do is we're going to place one, two, three snow, one black wool, and two snow. So right now it's three blocks tall and six blocks wide. The fourth row is one light blue, one blue, and four snow. The fifth row is one snow, one light blue, one blue, one black wool. I'll just uh, back up a bit and slow down just in case you can't quite keep up. And two snow. And the sixth and final row is one snow, one blue wool, three light blue wool, and one snow. And that is a six by six square, as you can see. If you want to, feel free to pause right now. And this is essentially the front of the body. So, the rest of the body is pretty plain and pretty easy to do, so we'll get to that in a second. Uh, but again, that's six tall, six wide. We've got three layers, which consists of the scarf, and then we've got the two buttons, and the rest is just snow. Okay, so, for the sides, what we're going to do is we're going to come to the side, of course, and we're going to extend it one, two, three, backwards. One, two, three. We're then going to build up five using snow, so that's one, two, three, four, five, five, five. And once you've done that, that gives you a 6x4. Six, four. six tall, four wide of snow, and then that one light blue block there. Ideally, we don't want that there, but if we get rid of it, it makes the scarf look awful. So uh, we have to keep it. But for this side, that's not an issue. We can just build up five all the way across, and it's nice and plain uh, snow. As you can see, six tall, four wide. Perfect. So the back side of the body is just pure snow. So this four gap here, we're going to build up five all the way across. And... Uh, basically create a 6x6 square of snow and once you've done that you have essentially built the body that is a 6 tall 6 wide by 4 deep I guess uh, cuboid I'm not quite sure of the uh, technical term it's been a while since I uh, did any form of maths at school <laughs> a long long time um, so I know some of you will put the correct shape in the uh, in the comments and I'll uh, definitely bear that in mind for next time. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it is. I can't remember. Um, but anyways, moving on. So for this part, you're going to want to make sure you're at the front. We're then going to build a 2x2 two two of snow on either side. So on the left side and the right side. And there'll be a two block gap in the middle if you've done it correctly. Now on top of that, you're going to place another 2x2 two two on each side. And that turns it into two 2x2x2 two by two by two cubes of snow. So that's one on the left, two block gap, one on the right. And that represents his feet. Now if you want to be really technical, and uh, I know some of you will be, this next part you can use wood, so wooden planks instead, because technically snowmen they tend to have sticks as hands, um, and they don't really tend to have legs, but because it's a plushie we're giving him legs, whether you like it or not. Um, so for the arms, what I'm going to do is go from here, so on the top left side we go out diagonal towards us, we then go to the left one, and then two forwards, like that. That makes a two by two, and then we bring it down one and make a two by two by two cube. Um, again, you can use wooden planks if you want to be like technical and uh, use sticks as his arms. Alternatively, you could just have like a wild like trail of uh, wooden planks coming out of his arms to represent sticks. But, again, that's up to you. I'm just giving you the base design. If you want to uh, alter it and change it to your liking, then you are more than welcome to do so. So, the right side is the exact same. We go out diagonal towards us, and then to side two. 
and then also down one layer on all the way across to make a 2x2x2 two by two by two cube and his right hand. So progress report, what we have so far we have a pair of legs or feet and a pair of arms both being 2x2x2 two by two by two cubes and we have a body which is 6 tall, 6 wide and 4 deep. So what's that leave us with? That leaves us with the head and the hat, so we'll work on the head now. So for the head, what we're going to do is make sure it's at the front. Right here on top of the snow block here, we're going to place one snow, bring it forwards, and one, two, three, whoops, four, five, to the right. We're then from here going to go one, two, three, four, five to the right, one, two, three, four, five, and then one, two, three. And it will link up together, and I'll just fill this in so you can see visually what it should be looking like. Um, it will give you a six by six square, and that's essentially the base plate for the head. So we've got the left side, back side, uh, right side, and front side of the head. And all we need to do is just build up on this base plate. So make sure at the front, again, we're going to start working on the face. On the first row, we're going to come to the third and fourth block, punch them out and replace with black wool. And go up diagonal to left and right on either side with black wool. Now that's to make his smile. Now in these gaps here, we're just going to place snow. And that's the first two rows complete. Now if you want to give him like a sly grin, you can get rid of that one and... Uh, replace it with snow, but I'm going to make him a nice happy snowman, a nice friendly snowman, and give him a, a big old grin. Um, okay, so the third layer is six snow. The fourth layer is one snow, one black wool, two snow, one black wool, one snow, and then the fifth and sixth layers are just pure snow. So once you've done that, it looks something like this. That is a six by six square, and uh, it looks pretty goofy pretty weird so what we're going to do is add the carrot nose and uh, it kind of makes it look a hell of a lot better so right here in between the eyes and the uh, mouth we've got this one layer here so in terms of height this is the third layer up and the third and fourth block in from the left a third and fourth block in from the right so the middle two blocks on the third row what we're going to do is place two orange wool 3d so make it uh, like stick out from the uh, face and then on the right side, we're going to make it stick out one more to almost give it like the uh, pointiness of a carrot, even though it's not a carrot. But it makes it look a lot better than if you did it like that, in my opinion. Uh, just doing it like that makes it look somewhat just a bit more like a carrot. So hopefully you get uh, my vibe, get where I'm going at with this. Again, you could probably make it just a tad bigger, extend out one, but then I think it looks a bit too big. Um, so again, it's up to you. Your uh, creativity is... I guess your limitation. If you, if you want to make it bigger, then feel free. If you want to change it, then feel free. Um, but for the tutorial, this is what I'm going to do. Three orange blocks, two there, and then one on the right side. So that's pretty much it. All we do for the rest of the head is just build up five all the way across. So just following the outline of the head, uh, going all the way around. And it will bring you back around to the front. So it's just pure snow, solid snow, no detail. Um, and then we can move on to the final detail of this build which is of course his top hat can't have a snowman without a top hat so as you can see this is the front six by six we have the left side which is pure snow six by six the back side six by six the right side you guessed it six by six now the top side we're just going to fill in here with snow for now and then we're going to cover it up with this little accessory we're going to build on top so for the hat I went for a more circular hat rather than the conventional like square one um, because I'm trying to make make it as circular as possible. Technically, you could probably get rid of these blocks here and uh, make it just a tad more circular because after all, it is a snowman um, that we're trying to build and it is a bit blocky. Um, but of course, it's Minecraft, so we are pretty limited when it comes to that. So again, you can feel free to take out the corners, make it more circular. Uh, but I think it looks kind of cool how it is anyways. Um, but that might be me just being biased. So anyways, for the hat, the final feature, what we're going to do, again, from the front, we go to the second row and the third and fourth block, and we place two black wool like so. We then go one to the left, one to the right. We go forwards one, and then link it up diagonally like so. And that gives us a two by two in the middle, and it should be one block in from either side, and perfectly centered, as you can see. So that's circular, if you wanted to do it square you could just fill in the blocks at the corners and it will give you a square hat, but of course again I'm trying to make it more circular. Um, so in this middle part we just fill that in and on top we build a 2x2 two two cube of black wool right in the middle and then we have these ones sticking out at the bottom either side and once you've done that, that is a top hat. 
Now, it looks better from the side, um, in my opinion, because you can kind of see like the circular part. Uh, it will look slightly different if you fill in the corners, of course. And I'll show you what it looks like. There you go. So from the front, it looks better if you fill in the corners. From the sides, it looks better if you don't. So again, your choice. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. So if you've followed this tutorial, you'll have something looking like this. Um, if my Xbox won't freeze, please don't. Um, and you'll have yourself your very own snowman plushie. And with that, I must conclude that this has been the final video of the year for my channel. So hopefully you enjoyed. Again, hopefully 2016 is as prosperous for the channel and uh, everything I create. Because it's been a hell of a lot of fun. And uh, I hope you've enjoyed it just as much as I have. Uh, but anyways, thank you for sticking around for the year. And uh, until next year, thanks for watching. I've been Tom Mogami and goodbye. Pull my heart out of my chest Train my mind so I forget Sink your teeth into my bones Dig me out then fill the hole Tear me apart